I've grown up with my dad running a business. So we basically lived on top of my dad's office because that was the very beginning of their business. And obviously, my dad had to sell his house just to invest the money into the business. And so I actually saw from the very beginning of my life how to hustle because my parents have kind of modeled that for me. And in the beginning, they were like living on top of the office. And I see like the everyday hustle where my dad has like one employee at that time and he's the one that's doing the work while my dad goes out because this is the time where people don't have internet they go out and actually find clients. He was going out there finding clients and he had one employee stayed in the office that's doing all the job. I grew up on a cattle ranch in a very small town in Salmon, Idaho. My dad, I remember from a very young age, I asking him like why he chose that. And he said, cause I could never have a boss. And that really struck me cause I'm like, wow, I look at the life that you live and how hard it is to run this business, right? There was no time off. It was just like blood, sweat, and tears in every moment in, in your in the business. And so I remember thinking like, oh, wow, I don't ever want to do that. So I went into the corporate world thinking, well, this is where I have that, you know, life work balance slash harmony, whatever that looks like. And I worked my way up to the, you know, one step away from that corner office and realized, wow, that freedom isn't here at all. This is where I thought I was going to find that freedom and flexibility. This is absolutely where it doesn't exist. And I basically hit the eject button on a 15 year corporate career that I had built 